today we're going to make homemade hand sanitizer. Okay, here we go. We are going to take this old bottle. We are going to put rubbing alcohol, 91%. This bottle is 16 fluid ounces. And aloe vera. You're not going to use this whole big old jug because that's just silly. So, I've already pre-measured how much is 6.4 ounces. So, I'm going to put the rubbing alcohol in the container. I'm going to put aloe vera in the 6.4 ounce marked container. And I'm going to pour it into the jug and wash it, or and mix it. When I'm done with that, voila, you will have homemade hand sanitizer that costs you the amount of one bottle of rubbing alcohol and a big old jug of aloe vera. The beauty of this is, this can be put in the fridge. It can actually be used for all sorts of other things that I didn't know about, but it's good for sunburns. That one I do recommend because I use aloe vera lotion on my sunburns. Not that I get them often, but um, it's got to be refrigerated. That's the only thing. So make sure you have room in your fridge for this big old jug because you're only going to use, like I said, 6.4 ounces with 16 ounces of rubbing alcohol. And then you have hand sanitizer. Okie dokie. And here you have the finished product. Ignored the label on the bottle because this is homemade. I just reused a hand sanitizer container. This is the aloe vera that I used and this is the rubbing alcohol that I used. Now, I now have roughly 20 ounces little over 20 ounces of hand sanitizer for a very little amount of money and in a, the shortage that we're having now due to the virus going on at least I know my family has hand sanitizer well with all the rubbing alcohol I have probably for a long time if you want the formula this is kinda hard to see but there you go it's one um, again, 16 ounce, sorry, 16 ounce bottle of 91% rubbing alcohol. And then you will put in, I have it written right on the label so I don't forget, uh, 6.4 fluid ounces of the aloe vera. You mix it up and there you have hand sanitizer. Quick and simple. Y'all stay safe and stay healthy. And thanks for joining me at Western New York Wildlife Hotspots. We do all sorts of stuff on this site. Have a great day. Stay healthy. Thanks. See you again soon. If you like my video, please hit the like and then hit the subscribe button. It will help me out.